Hello. In this video, we are going to look at the one sample t test. We are in Jamovi. We're going to go over here to t tests and select one sample t test. Now, one sample t test is looking at the difference between two means. That's your t test. But more specifically, we are going to look at what a perhaps a desired value is, or maybe a hypothetical value, or maybe the value of of the known general population, like 100 is would be the value for IQ of the overall population. And we are going to test if the value we have in our sample is not equal to that value. So in this case, let's say for servant leadership, we have a value of 100 we want to reach. So we have some managers, they need to be at, one, at a score of 100 for servant leadership. We'll go ahead and select our value, move it over to dependent variable, and then I'll click also descriptives. We can see here that the mean score of our sample is 89.7. And here's your p-value, which if it's less than 0.05 alpha level, then it's statistically significant. In this case, it's actually below 0.001. It is significant, meaning 89.7 is significantly lower than 100. Now, just to show you what happens if we put this value at, one, at 90, well, you can see here that 90 is very close to 89.7, and sure enough, it is no longer a statistically significant difference between the two values. Two other simple little features here in Jamovi is you can also test if the value is going to be greater than your test value or if the value is going to be less than your test value. In this case, we just wanted to see the two tails, two directional, to see if it's just not equal to our test value. 